Okay, it's not going to be quite as windy today. I wanted to point that out before that ah, went away. I <laughs> reset that meter for the, the Missouri turbine. Uh, it's not quite as windy today as it's going to be, or as it was a couple of days ago, but it's windy enough that the four major turbines are, are going. Uh, we're, we're moving about 10 or 15 miles an hour outside. The gusts get up to 20 something. Uh, it's supposed to be windier a little later this afternoon. So we're going to see how uh, how the turbines all do today. So it's going to be from now it is about 9 a.m. And we're going to probably shut down about 9 p.m. tonight and see how much power they make. So we're sitting at 13 kilowatts for the Healy, 6,000 watts for the I-1500, and just about 1,400 watts for the washing machine turbine. And like I said, I reset the meter for the Missouri turbine. We'll see what they do. They've got all got a very nice clean wind coming out of the southeast, west, southwest, coming out of the southwest. No obstructions. Everything is 100 yards away or more and below it. All right, let's see what they do. Okay, we're only about an hour into it. Uh, winds are holding steady, usually 15 to 20 miles an hour. Gusts are starting to get closer to 30 miles an hour whenever they really pick up. We can see our Missouri turbines only made 22 watt hours so far. Had a pretty good jump on the washer turbine and the I-1500. Kind of wish I'd reset the Healy whenever we started this because we only get to see it every thousand watts. But moving on along. Alright, so our, our our line winds or straight winds, whatever, they're still running right around 15 to 20 miles an hour, but we're getting gusts real frequently getting up there to 25 to 40 miles an hour. My little meter saw 34 at ground level. And uh our Missouri turbine sitting at 63 watt hours now. Another kilowatt hour off of the Healy. The uh, man, my brain just went away there. The I-1500 sitting at 7,000 watt hours. I think that's 500 watt hours more than what it was just a little while ago, an hour or so ago and then nearly 300 watt hours coming off of the washing machine turbine. This is where we are now. Our, uh, <laughs> our setup here is actually pumping 2,000 watts back into the grid. Upwards of. Things are, that one's, this one's getting a little warm. That's not too bad. That one's cold, almost. Heat seek's a little bit warmer on this one. I think this heat seek's working better than that one. That's yeah. This one is uh, pretty warm. That one's pretty warm. Eh, that one's all right. But yeah, that's where we're at so far. It's been two, maybe three hours into it. We started at nine, it's about 12, so about three hours. We'll walk back out here right quick and just get a little bit more footage of the wind. And we'll come check on it again here in a little bit.
get underneath the Healy. You see that shroud still loose? I keep hoping that'll <laughs> just wrap around the hub and break off one day, but it ain't yet. This still needs to be a little bit more balanced than what it is. There it goes. I actually think it needs a little bit more weight on the on the counterweight. It tilts back earlier than I like to see. back and it goes back right around 1500 watts 1800 watts somewhere in that area sorry if I'm yelling at my phone it's very windy I'd rather like to see it tilt back around uh, 2000 but anyway that's where we're at okay we're another hour or so down and we are looking at 126 watt hours on the uh, Missouri turbine. So that's 16 kilowatt hours on the Healy. 7,842 on the I-1500. 2,200 on the washer turbine. Okay, sitting around 4.30. We got 228 on the Missouri turbine, 18 kilowatt hours on the Healy, 8,900 watts on the I-1500, 2,621 watts on the washer turbine. It's still going pretty hard. As again, we're talking 15 to 20 miles an hour most of the time gusts are getting up to 40 miles an hour a little over still we're supposed to be getting two maybe three more hours of this stuff okay we're sitting at six o'clock the wind has died down a quite quite a lot uh, actually the uh, Missouri turbine with all those blades is still having a hard time still going Everything else is still turning. We're still making a little bit. We've probably got maybe two hours, uh, maybe two hours of uh, producing wind still. And our total so far for the Missouri turbine is made another 70 watt hours. The, uh, well, yes, you know, we're at 289 now. The Healy 2.0 is in at 20 kilowatt hours. It's made roughly 2 kilowatt hours since the last time. The I-1500 is sitting at 95.52. This is only made about 6 kilowatt hours. I mean, 600 watts. Man, I can't keep that straight. It's made about 600 watts since the last time we looked at it. And the washer turbine sitting at... 2849 uh, again about 600 watts so we'll come back here shortly I imagine I will get one more reading right at uh, roughly nine o'clock that's when we expect it all to die okay we are at the end of our day uh, it's really only about 8 15 maybe 8 30 I forgot to actually look at the clock before I started filming and I have to stop filming to find that uh, the only two turbines that are still running are the Healy and the I-1500. And as you can see, we're right now, we, we've got maybe 10 or 15 miles an hour going out there. Probably 10. And they're, they're picking up and spiking periodically. The uh, Missouri turbine starts turning every now and then. But for the most part, the Missouri turbine and the washer motor turbine are, are dead. And the Healy and I-1500 are mostly you know down into double digits and single digits the uh, only reason that the Healy is still making power is once it starts running 
the wind has to come to a complete stop for it to die off. And we're probably going to have, you know, 5, 10 miles an hour all night. Uh, so it, it'll continue to make a little bit of power. Everything else is about dead in the water. And we're going to do a little cheat in here to see what the... Uh, what the Missouri turbine did. Two hundred and ninety-two watts for the day. Two hundred and ninety-two watts for the day. We started at zero this morning. Two ninety-two right now. The Healy 2.0 sitting at 20 kilowatt hours. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know if that's 20,000... 900 watts or 20,100 watts. We could be almost an entire kilowatt hour different between the two. But this gauge doesn't tell me that way. So we got to go with 20 kilowatt hours. The I-1500 is sitting at 9,747 watt hours. And the washer turbine is at 2,878 watt hours. Now, I don't know off the top of my head, because I can't remember these kinds of things on a whim, what we started with. So we are going to have the totals on the screen. Right now, up here at the top of the screen, I have been keeping track as, as it goes along. And our totals are going to be displayed in this general area. So I hope that you guys find this useful. Uh, if you don't find it useful, I'm sorry. Uh, outside of that, I really, really appreciate everybody watching and uh, supporting me this year. I am almost at 4,000 subscribers, so a little exciting for me. <laughs> um, and that's that. Guys, again, thanks for watching. I hope all of you have a wonderful, safe evening. And I hope you had a great year. Good night.